An old priest once expressed this beautiful thought. Bread is a food that will keep when preserved. That is why Christ chose to remain in the world under the form of bread, not only to feed his lovers in holy communion, but also to be preserved in the tabernacle. There he would stay with us always. There we would have an ever-present reminder of his love. Saint Paul is astounded to see Jesus take on the form of a slave. But what should we say when we see him take on the form of bread? Saint Peter Alcantara said that words can give no idea of the love Jesus has for souls that are his friends. To make sure these souls would not forget him, he has chosen to live near them in this sacrament. He wants nothing to come between him and his faithful friends. My Jesus, you are here in the tabernacle precisely to listen to those who come to tell you their troubles and to ask you for help. I beg you to listen to this ungrateful sinner. My heart is heavy as I kneel here before you. Heavy because I see how much I have displeased you. I have stung your heart with my sins. Will you forgive and forget everything? There is something else too. I have seen how good and kind you are, and I have fallen in love with you. I want to love you, to please you. But I am a weakling. I need help. O oh, great Lord, show heaven your power. Change my selfishness into genuine love. I know you can do it. I know you want to do it. Give me the means to love you with all my heart. At least let my love be as selfless as my sins have been selfish. My Jesus, I love you more than anything else in the world. I love you even more than my own life.